More people are benefiting from a program designed to keep them in their homes. In just three months, the Housing Retention Project at East River Legal Services has helped 29 adults who may have otherwise faced eviction. In tonight's Eye on Kelloland, Lauren Solick takes a look at how the program has been doing so far this year and the benefit it has from both property managers and tenants. Alpine Property Management is one of the companies that has signed up with the Housing Retention Project at East River Legal Services. But it has been great for our, our property owners and our tenants being able to um, have that resource to send our tenants to um, to get assistance when they're needing it and then for our, our property owners just to to keep their houses um, full um, and, and not to have that that lost tenant where they have to you know go through an eviction process or or turn over a unit just to keep that keep that house occupied with with a family. The project is a liaison between tenants, property managers, and owners, and it's helped Alpine Property Management avoid evictions. At the very beginning stages of that eviction process, we send out as many resources as we can. And then in particular, what we've been able to do is refer those tenants to Allison's program. And if we can, then we can prevent some of the things that are causing these problems and stop that eviction process, keep them in their home. Allison Thompson is the one who helps tenants find the resources they might need so they can keep paying their rent. Sometimes it's not just about um, the financial assistance, it's a family that's struggling with something else that can uh, be a financial hard, create a financial hardship in their household, and then maybe being able to connect them with all their resources, then we can help them stay home as well. The program was developed by the group Sioux Falls Thrive to help with the thousand plus kids whom they say become homeless each school year in Sioux Falls. This year, Thompson has been able to help 21 children. We have seen so many changes in our community, the pandemic, all these things can impact our families in Sioux Falls. Sometimes uh, people doesn't have childcare, people doesn't have support, or um, they're just going through a hard patch right now. And then for me being able to be there, help them figure out a plan and get them connected with some resources, that can definitely make the difference. Some nonprofit organizations in Sioux Falls have recently started reaching out to Thompson to be those resources for tenants. And we're all working together as a team so we can provide various services for our clients. We also have the county has shown a lot of interest and has been working with us through some of their program as well. And two new landlords have signed up for the program since January. One large benefit is just the time savings. Um, not only for the tenant, but for us as property managers too, knowing that if we're sending um, a tenant that's going through some hardships over to Allison, um, that they're going to follow up with us too. So we, it, it saves us time um, in trying to work through some of those situations with the tenant. And then from a tenant's perspective also, just to have one person that they can go to and, and they don't have to go um, you know, from place to place looking for the, the assistance, that they can just go to one place and um, and get everything that they need is a huge benefit to our tenants. It's never a good day when somebody loses their home. And sometimes things happen in a tenant's life that the, the wheels just come off the bus and they, they can't keep going. So if we can give them resources to stay in their home and keep them there, then that's a good day for everybody. With Eye on Kelloland, I'm Lauren Solick. Along with Alpine Property Management, Lloyd Companies and Thieves and Tal Property Management are also signed up with the Housing Retention Project. Property managers can apply to be in the program by visiting the East River Legal Services website. Then the tenants of those enrolled property managers can seek assistance. At this time, the program is focused on affordable housing options for lower income families. Up next, we take a look at the drive.